don't have to tell you things are bad. Everybody knows things are bad. The dollar buys a nickel's worth. Banks are going bust. Shopkeepers keep a gun under the counter. Punks are running wild in the street. There's nobody anywhere who seems to know what to do, and there's no end to it. We know the air is unfit to breathe, and our food is unfit to eat. We sit watching our TVs while some local newscaster tells us that today we had 15 homicides and 63 violent crimes, as if that's the way it's supposed to be. We know things are bad, worse than bad. They're crazy. It's like everything everywhere is going crazy, so we don't go out anymore. We sit in the house, and slowly the world we're living in is getting smaller, and all we say is, please, at least leave us alone in our living rooms. Let me have my toaster and my TV and my steel-belted radios, and I won't say anything. Just leave us alone. Well, I'm not going to leave you alone. I want you to get mad. It's been a rough week. The world hasn't been nice to me, but it never was. Responsibilities weigh heavy in the heart of art. Spark an idea, erase and revise, face the lord of the flies or father of lies. The revolution will not be televised. Rather hosted by Tupac Shakur's hologram and AI on TikTok or Instagram Live. The family ties begin to slip. The knot is loose. It's been a rough month. I call a truce with myself instead of tying this noose. I'm tired of the constant violent abuse. Truce. It's been a rough year. My hands are shaking. My happiness cost an arm and a leg and I need to amputate it. Nana was a cancer patient and died from it. Jeremy passed, I cannot hide from it. I'm eager for a transformation. I'm eager for it. Yeah.